We are out here at Campbell University today because anti-choicer Kristen Hawkins is out here spreading misinformation. Let's go see what she has to say. Hi, how are you? Can I answer any questions you have about abortion? I'm pro-choice because it's my body, my choice. What do you have to say about that? Well, what about the, the child's choice? That's a separate body. You certainly don't believe if you become pregnant with a man that you develop a penis, do you? But it's a clump of cells. But I'm a clump of cells. Can you abort me and violently dismember, violently dismember me? You're just forcing your religion on me. Actually, being pro-life isn't a religious view at all because science says life begins at conception and pro-lifers just say when life begins, when that human begins, they shouldn't be violently ended because of matters of convenience. But abortion is like totally safe though. Not really. Uh, tell that to the women who die like Kamaya Munger and Jennifer Morabelli, the women who die in America every year from legal abortion. And chemical abortion pills are actually four times uh, more dangerous and 10 times more deadly than surgical abortions. But you don't even actually care about women. Yes, I do. That's why I'm here. If you've ever cared to look at the pro-life movement, it's mostly women warning other women about the dangers of abortion. In fact, many post-abortive women, women who've paid to abort their children actually have joined the pro-life movement to warn other women the dangers of abortion on their bodies and their children. Well, I mean, it's just, I just think abortion is safe and you're spreading misinformation. Well, abortion is not safe. Would you like to go to AI, chat, GPT? You are anti-science. Uh, no, actually, I'm pro-science. 96% of biologists agree with the fact that life begins at the moment egg and sperm unite, unique whole living human being comes into existence. You just want to deny, deny science in order to live the life the way you see fit. I think we've had enough here with this anti-choicer. As you can see, we totally owned her. She had literally no answers and was only spreading misinformation. Come back next time for us to destroy another anti-choicer.